Hello YouTubers, I'm going to show you how to install the Carbon Ovation purple, black, or red theme that they have going. Uh, this theme does take a little bit of time, it's not just a simple download and install and you're good to go. You do have to set up all your icons, uh, how they're supposed to be. So it, it takes a little bit more time, probably up to an hour. Uh, some people might do it faster, some slower. But make sure you have time to do this or else your phone is just going to look all jumbled and everything if you quit in the middle of the process. So here's what you're going to need to actually get this to work. Uh, you're going to need the 5 icon dock, the 5 column spring bro springboard, eye blank, blank null, spring jumps, and categories. I'll have everything that you need in the description. And I could show you exactly how to get all these, but that's just going to waste time since most of you already know how to search for stuff. So just go right into search on Cydia and search what you're looking for, which would be the five that I listed. Along with the five things that you need, you're going to need the theme itself, which is carbon, ovation, and then whatever color you want. Black, pink, blue, purple, red. First off, what you're going to want to do is go into your categories which is something that you were supposed to download and it's just all the bunched up folders and create these folders apps games phone and miscellaneous spell you know it's spell it a the capital a p p s games with the capital g iphone small i big p uh, and then you know you know spell it um once you have all that spelled out uh, you will go into apps and add whatever apps you want in here that you do not want on the actual page uh, that you want hidden in your folder. So, I mean, the, I would put the less frequently used applications in this folder. Same with how the games work and all the other stuff. Put your less frequently used uh, stuff into these folders. What you want to do is after you have all your stuff downloaded, open Spring Jumps, and once you open Spring Jumps, go into the Jump Icons, and leave all of them on except for page 7 and page 8. You will not need page 7 and page 8. Get rid of those. Once you've done that, you want to open up iBlank. What iBlank is, is it creates blank applications. Click on 16 because you want to make as many as you can. And crap, I actually clicked it and I'm going to, have to delete all of them. I regret that. Um, and after it creates all your blanks, it's going to restart again. Now, once you have all of your uh, spring jumps and all, all the application that you need, this is how you want to set up your actual spring jumps, which is one, two, zero, three, four, and that's basically you know spring jump jumps to the pages that you're going to be going to. So when you click on zero, it's going to go to page zero. Uh, this page is very important. Your page zero. Uh, you want your messages, phone, mail, and then it, you want it to jump to page five. Uh, at least that's how I set it up. The next page is how you want to set up your actual iPhone. Uh, you know, all your iPhone apps, which is the map, the camera, the photos, YouTube, etc., etc. Uh, some people leave out the, you know, the bottom two, and they just, uh, they just, you know, have the three rows. Uh, I prefer to do it this way because right here is where your time is going to show up. So as long as you leave these two blank, that's the best way to go. Miscellaneous. Uh, the miscellaneous is going to be your basically your Cydia page, your hacking page. So I put my winter board and my eye blank and my spring jumps and Cydia and categories in there. All the stuff that I get from Cydia I put on this page. Uh, then you can set up your apps how you like it. Put your favorite apps uh, right here, and then I'll show you exactly how to get more apps inside of the app folder. Games. I don't have any games, but you set up exactly the same. And this is going to be like your internet page. Uh, I haven't really bothered to figure out where I want these two. By now, you will know how this theme works, and you could put them exactly where you want them, so I just haven't bothered. And this is just simply jumping to page six. That's a star. 
So it's irrelevant. So now that you have all of your icons set up where they're supposed to be, you have spring jumps uh, set up for your uh, pages getting rid of uh, the last two. Uh, you have your blanks, you have your categories, everything is set up and everything is good to go. You will download, if not already, downloaded your theme, open up winter board, and pick which one you want and it's obviously going to be carbon ovation, choose your color here. Click it, get out. And it will obviously respring. I'm sure most of you have already updated or made a used theme, so you know that it's going to have to respring. And once that's done, it's set up. Uh, and now that you understand the blank spots and everything like that, you won't have to get out of the theme just to adjust it. You simply fix any error that you have by holding down on the apps. And there you go. You still see all your blanks and everything like that. So, there. I didn't want to make this too thorough. Uh, it's just a quick little get through it. I'm sure most of you can figure it out. But figuring it out on your own can take a while. Especially if you're not signed up on their forums. So, there you go. Hope this helps. Please subscribe. Till next time.